A Lee County deputy is at an Austin hospital recovering after being shot last night at a home in Dimebox. That's a small community north of Giddings. Fox 7 Austin's Rudy Koski is live there with an update. Hey, Rudy. Hi, Casey. Uh, Amanda, yeah, you're hearing the sirens going off, the, maybe, maybe even the courthouse bell just a moment ago. It's the noon hour here uh, in Giddings. Uh, this case is still under investigation, we're told, and information is being very limited at, that's coming out. But here's what we know. The Lee County deputy, we're told, was hit in the neck and airlifted to Austin last night. The shooting happened when deputies came to Dine Box, a very small community, last night to serve a warrant. Now, they were trying to arrest an individual by the name of Raul Perez. He was wanted for sexual assault of a child. Now, the images from the scene were provided uh, to Fox 7 by Giddings Times and news reporter Frank Smith. According to the Lee County Sheriff's Office, their deputy and a trooper located Perez, who was along uh, Stephen F. Austin Boulevard in Dimebox. We're told Perez entered a home as the deputy and the trooper gave chase. Now, when the deputy was shot, the trooper returned fire, we're told, and Perez was later found inside the house dead from a gunshot wound. Now, earlier in the day, authorities put out information to the community warning them that Perez was last seen in the area and that he was to believe, uh, believed to be armed and dangerous. It also was noted that he has a long criminal history, including a murder charge. The name of the deputy who was shot has not yet been released to the public. We'll have a follow-up to this and also later on today how drone technology helped bring this whole thing to an end. That'll be tonight at 5. Now back to you in the studio.